Welcome to the Asphalt Video Store. Today is a mail lot video. Yes, another mail lot video. It's been a while since I've done one and all that. And also, you might notice a different environment here. And I'm it's the other side of the wall to my room. I'm doing this video really quick because in 20 minutes, I have to like leave to somewhere and all that. It's currently 9.25 in the morning. I have to leave somewhere by 10 o'clock and all that. So what I got in the mail is two packages from uh, eBay, as you see here. Uh, this package and also this box. Both of them are roughly the same size. The package is a bit smaller so let's open that one first. You know smallest to biggest. Let's see what's in here. I have to like open it like this because it shows my address in the other side. Oh well, look you guys can already see what's in there. All right it's a shirt. It looks like a Hawaiian shirt. You know the uh, ooh, it's actually really soft with the material. I like it. Any case, so you may be asking why did I got a shirt? Is because I'm planning to for Halloween this year. I'm planning to dress up as Ralph Duke from Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas, based on the book of the same name, written by Hunter S. Thompson and all that. So I got the shirt instead of liking like the costume they have for so and all that. I got the shirt so it could feel a little bit authentic instead of like being a little bit costume like. It's sort of similar to the actual shirt that was to that Ralph Rook, Ralph Duke course and all of that. Although there's a bit more colors instead of like being two colors like the black for the background and the orange yellow some like that for the flowers and none of these like leaves. But yeah, I'm happy with the shirt I got and all of that. It was like 18 bucks and it's a pretty good deal. Oh, maybe I might wear it later on too just to see how it feels when wearing it. Okay, now the lighting is completely different. I was losing a lot of sun, and just, the video just started, started getting dark, darker and all that, so now you can now see me and all that. So yeah, I hope my costume will turn out well, but so far it looks like it will. The next package we're gonna open is from eBay. Okay, I can't find my knife, but I found scissors and all of that. So let's open it from here. I'm going to like cut the tape here very slowly. Can't show the other side. It might be easier to open like that, but my address is there. Maybe you should start a PO box so that when hey the only address I will reveal is my my PO box and I see it like from like here and all that. But basically, this was just a lucky thing to buy. Basically, I got this from an eBay auction, and somehow I was lucky enough to be the only bidder to actually win and all that. And I got it really for a really good price. But I'll, I will show you it after I open this uh, package here. And there we go. Can okay, I just open it like this? Da na 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 da na dun 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 dun. Yes, a VHS tape of the Human Vapor. So this is a film from 1960. And it was directed by Shiro Honda, the same director who directed the Godzilla movies. And this is the US version that was released on VHS by Video Gems in this big box. Let's actually look at it clearly by opening the bubble wrap. Oh, look at that. Look at this. It's, it might be a little bit green on the camera because of the lighting. So yeah, this box is a little, not a little, a lot beat up and all that. From like just from looking through the bubble wrap it actually looks a little bit better than whatever I got here and all that. But it looks like a lot better than the last war where the cover itself looked like it was very faded. Lost its color and all that. Look at these screenshots. They look very stressed. It's the movie's widescreen and all that. So and the speech to say but I'm presuming is like you know like cropped to 4 by 3 But these screenshots look so like like they were squeezed to be 4x3 and all that in order to fit the box. And I got the VHS tape for another reason is that there's a video by, I forgot who, I think it was the H-Man or some other YouTube. I think it was the H-Man. And he uploaded a video where he compares this uh, VHS to release to a TV airing of the movie. And it shows that the TV airing shows uh, more footage than this VHS tape. And he was like, oh, I didn't actually, I don't actually own the VHS tape. I got it from a, like a, a website and all that, you know. And I was like, okay, that might be a little bit untrustworthy there. If you just download it from a website, what if, you know, they cut it? 
I didn't know that. So I got this VHS tape to test it to see if the footage is missing. Also, there is another VHS release of this movie. I forgot what company, but it's a slim case and it has a weird looking VHS cover. It's, it looks like it was trying to get like an artistic approach to it and all that, but it just looks a little bit weird and all that. In case, this is the second VHS tape I have a video of the Video Gems release of the Toho and Brenko Pictures movies because this movie was uh, Americanized by Brenko Pictures along with The Last War and Gorath. I do have the last four VHS tape, but I don't have the Gorath VHS tape. The weird thing is that the Video James release is the only VHS release of The Last War. The other two, The Human Baby and Gorath, they got their VHS release through Prism Entertainment. According to this label, this comes from a video store called Video Gallery. So, it doesn't have an address though, because remember our, my other video just take the extra amount of space, it does have an address to the video store that the tape came from because it was like a cut box. When I googled it, the, it looks like the video store sign was still there, but not like, it didn't say video store, it was like the actual like place where the sign was, it was still there, but the video store was like closed out unfortunately. So I wonder what happened to video gallery, probably they went out of business or... There, it's still there for some reason. So yeah, you, this is like really cool to have. So that is my mail lot of today. I got two cool things from eBay. A shirt and a VHS tape. But in case, so that's all the video. Have a nice day and later on come back to our video store.